Hi, it's John. I've been asked to talk about picking and how to pick fast. There's a few little tricks to get your picking really up to speed, and really fast and really fluid. There's a few of the greats do it, like Malmsteen or Paul Gilbert, Steve Vai, any of the kind of guys, Van Halen, the guys who are associated with this fast rock style picking. What I'm going to do is zoom into that last lick, which was just an E minor or G major lick. I'm going to show you the mechanics of what was going on with the right hand. Okay. Let's take a look closely at the notes I'm using in this sequence. We're using a three note per string scalar approach to this, just in a minor scale run. And what we're doing is starting from the fifth fret of the B string, picking, then hammering on seven and eight. Then on the same frets on the E string, picking all three notes. So that sequence, pick, hammer, hammer, pick, pick, pick. With a relaxed right hand if you can. Then we're gonna move up, go seven, eight, and 10, with exactly the same picking technique. So picking the first note, hammering two and three, then picking the last three. Moving up to eight, 10, and 12. Exactly the same sequence. Same thing again, 10, 12, and 14. Finishing on our home note, which is G. This technique involves picking the first note on that B string and then letting a hammer on take the next two. And then picking on the E string the last three with alternate picking. So you're only picking four out of the six notes in this sequence, which is kind of fooling people's ears into thinking you're playing all six notes picked. And up to speed. But it makes for a much tidier sounding picked sequence on record rather than, you could do it individually. But you get a lot more pick noise, a lot more sort of noise that's unwanted really when you're recording a fast part. If we use this technique, we get a lot better results and a lot smoother sound. Hopefully that helps you guys who want help right hand picking. Okay, so if you want to get in touch with any other queries or requests, please contact me on the email link.